Hi everyone, are you looking for a great township in New Jersey? A place where there's a great school district and also uh, there's a lot of space. You don't need to worry about parking and shopping is convenient located everywhere and also easy commute to New York City. You come to the right place because today I'm going to talk about a township in Central Jersey that has just all of that. My name is Fei Yan, a real estate agent from Keller Williams, and I work in central New Jersey. So East Brunswick is just one of the local townships that I cover. So in today's video, I'm going to talk about the community, the schools, transportation, shopping, and restaurants. All the good stuff, I'm going to bring it to you. The township of East Brunswick is located in Middlesex County. The community is considered part of the New York City metropolitan area located on the south shore of Raritan River, adjacent to the city of New Brunswick. Now, let's not confuse. There's actually four Brunswicks in Central Jersey, New Brunswick, North Brunswick, South Brunswick, and East Brunswick. East Brunswick actually has the best school district, so just don't confuse with the other Brunswicks. Now, in East Brunswick, the town has a total of 2,270 square miles of land and located inland south of Revton River with a population of 47,819. It is one of the best places to live in New Jersey. Living in East Brunswick Township offers residents a dense suburban feel and most residents own their homes. East Brunswick is the 32nd largest community in New Jersey. East Brunswick is a white collar town with 88.9% of the workforce employed in white collar jobs, well above the national average. Overall, East Brunswick is a town of professional sales and office workers and managers, especially a lot of people in East Brunswick who work in the management occupation, office and administrative support and sales jobs. The township received an overall grade of A plus in niches.com, named one of the best places to live in New Jersey. Let's talk about the housing. Um, the medium estimate home value in East Brunswick is $460,000. And for the last 12 months, the price has increased about 11%. The medium home age in East Township is about 49 years old and 81% of the people own the homes instead of rent. It's only about 19% of the people rent. Let's talk about East Brunswick schools. As you know, East Brunswick has a great school system. In this the school district consists of 11 schools and 8,259 students. East Brunswick has eight preschools, eight elementary school, two middle school, and one high school. East Brunswick High School is actually very popular. It's actually one of the national school of excellence. It's recognized by the U.S. Department of Education as one of the Blue Ribbon schools. Now in New Jersey, only nine of them, and East Brunswick is one of them. The recognition is based on school's overall academic performance. And as you can see, this is a great school district. And also the crime rate. East Brunswick is safer than majority of the cities, towns, and villages in America. And also has a low crime rate of 57% of the communities in New Jersey. According to uh, the Neighborhood Scout FBI crime data, it's a very safe township. Let's talk about transportation. Since East Brunswick is located in central Jersey, it's a uh, very easy access to everything. There's actually um, four major airports around by two, um, the Newark and LaGuardia and JFK, which is in New York, but it's not that far. And also the Philadelphia airport. So it's very easy for anybody who want, who like to travel and we are close to the airport. And also, if you are commute to New York City, there's a lot of buses that you could take to um, the Port Authority or Wall Street. That's uh, actually you could take the bus in um, Nelson's Plaza in the Tower Center. That's coach buses that you could take to Port Authority. It take about 40 minutes uh, to an hour, depends on the traffic and the weather. And also, there's 138 bus on Route 18 um, that you could take at Lincoln Tunnel to Port Authority. 
And that's also bus number 68 that goes to Jersey City where you could take the PATH trains. It usually take about 40 to 50 minutes. The bus runs um, every five to 10 minutes during rush hours and it costs about four to $16, depends on where you take the bus. And shopping, that's actually shopping, a lot of places you could go shopping. In Route 18, you can see there's a lot of shops, there's a lot of gas station, there's uh, strip malls, um, there's a lot of places you could go shopping. And one of the places is uh, East Brunswick Square Mall, which is in the intersection for Route 18 and Rose Lane. In this mall, it's about 60 stores that you could shop. So it's easy access, it's convenient, and you could actually uh, do a lot of shopping there too. Let's talk about park and recreations. There's a lot of parks in East Brunswick, and today we're just gonna talk about three. Heavenly Farms is one of the largest parks operated by the Township Division of Recreation. It features baseball and softball fields, bike trails, golf course, a dog park, football fields, lacrosse, and uh, soccer fields. And that's another one is Crystal Springs Family Water Park. This park has four various size pools, a splash park, water slides, and a lazy river. And you could do a lot of recreation activities in the summer. And then the last one is Ireland Brook Conservation Area. In this area, it's a nature reserve of forests, fields, nature trails, and wetlands. Too bad the day I went, it was winter, so it's closed right now. How about the restaurants? There are actually a lot of diversified uh, restaurants in East Brunswick, all different kind of ethnicity food. And uh, I just wanted to point out a few restaurants that um, I like. It's One is uh, Blue Water Seafood Restaurant. This is one of the best seafood restaurants in Middlesex County. It's uh, conveniently located in Route 18. The restaurant has a cozy and intimate atmosphere. The food is always great and fresh. And there's another restaurant, Koi Turkish Grill, is also known for dinner, Middle Eastern and Turkish food. And the food is very tasty, fresh and cooked, uh, ready to order. And uh, one of the restaurants is a very popular Asian restaurant called k -Pot. And uh, k -Pot is very unique. It's hand, it hands all you can eat, uh, dining experience. It's order to go. And the restaurant actually recently bought a robot waiter, uh, waitress. Uh, basically, uh, the robot will take you to your seat and bring food to you. It's actually very interesting. And the food is very fresh and you can order as much as you want and um, it come to your uh, table. And also East Brunswick has a few uh, wedding places. One of them is Park Charter Estates and Garden. It has a beautiful garden uh, with fountains and architecture is very beautiful and a lot of people get wedding there and you can take a look at inside also. And there's another wedding place is called Farrington Manor, which is also similar to the Park Chateau, and it's also very popular. You can take a look at those two places. Now, as you know, East Brunswick is a great place to live. The area is very safe, and there's uh, so many nice uh, neighborhoods. And East Brunswick actually have a few renovation and redevelopment projects going on. Uh, one of the major one is uh, they tried to uh, planning to modelize a 44 acres of property Route 18. They want to turn uh, it into a 500 million dollar mixed use development. It will not only attract new residents and business, but it also it will enrich the lives of those people who currently live in East Brunswick. And this is a redevelopment is a stretch on Route 18, south from Roof Street to Lake Avenue. A lot of the shopping area right now in the current uh, few blocks, it's been either uh, declined or not a lot of people go shopping or it's vacant, it's bought up. So they wanted to renovate this whole place. The local government wants to turn the 44 acres of land on Route 18 into new bus terminals and commuters parking garage, a modern hotel and tech center and on-site medical service office facility, 
and destinations such as uh, for restaurant and outdoor dining, shops, uh, walkways, water feature, essential public plaza, multiple opening uh, public greenways, and outdoor atmosphere to promote outdoor gathering and community events. So it's gonna be a beautiful place once they developed. The township officials are keeping details in close. The renovation, they start out in 2018. Right now, um, they're doing some sort of uh, legal stuff with the current residents. So this development will take place. So now I give you all the information about uh, East Brunswick Township. If you are thinking about coming to Central Jersey, I could definitely show you around. Um, East Brunswick is one of the places that has the best school district in Central Jersey. So there's actually a few others such as Homedale, Marlboro, and Monroe. If you wanted to find out about those uh, townships also, you can look at my uh, other videos. Thank you very much. I'll talk to you soon. Bye-bye.